So in this video, I'm going to talk about marketing, talk a bit about business in general. One of the things that I notice a lot about freelancers in particular is the idea of feast and famine. So it's like you do a bunch of marketing, you do a bunch of sales, you know, to convert those customers, take them through your pipeline, and then you do the work, you do the service delivery for the clients, and then you find yourself with no work and you're back to marketing. It's very cyclical and it causes peaks and troughs, especially in your cash flow when that can start to dry up. It's a matter of keeping the marketing going and having something in your calendar where you're doing some sales and marketing a few days a week or just a few hours or whatever it is, whatever it is to meet your goals. And what this all kind of comes back to, if you take a step back, you've got to think about how much revenue you actually want to make in a given month and make some projections about the actual levels of activity that you do. So you're going to come up with a spreadsheet, a bit of a test and measure on your marketing and you're going to do things like, right, I'm going to raise awareness of my business by doing some networking so you're going to attend some networking events but you're going to have some clear metrics to actually say look i'm going to go to four networking events a month or two a week or whatever it is eight eight a month whatever you, you can manage depending on the time that you've got and then you're going to set for every networking event i'm going to try and book some one-to-ones with a couple of those people who i meet and then you're going to try and convert a few of those into customers or you're going to be able to tap into their network and convert some of their contacts into customers rather than just turning up to a networking event for example and saying, oh yeah, I'll just see how it goes. You've got to have some numbers in mind. And that doesn't mean that you need to hard sell people while you're there because it really is about relationship building. It's not about selling or anything like that. But on the other hand, you do need to have a strategy in place and it does need to have some numbers around it because business essentially is all about numbers. 